Hello everybody, we are back with our annual Black Friday video. Happy Thanksgiving! Uh, we are alone this time. We don't have siblings. We don't have siblings? What happened well, to them? They're gone. They Not graduated yeah, and now they have yeah. jobs and yeah. lives in, without well, My us. brother's in another state and your sister's working today, but uh, we're alone this year. We Every year we do this on my channel, Black Friday, and we go to the only one place. We don't go anywhere else. Well, we go to, we go to three, three locations for this and now they have multiple locations. But um, Just Press Play, a locally owned video game chain here, kind of like, uh, I guess a lot of people would know, like the Pink Gorilla out in Washington, thanks to the Metal Jesus and stuff, like that type of thing. And they always have buy one, get one free on video games and DVD except box sets, for except Switch. for the Switch, which is, it's a new thing though, too, because Wii U was included oh, before yeah. previous yeah, ones. Is... So this is the first, like, since the, the Switch has been out, they're buy two, get one free, so we don't bother with the, the Switch, but. Because most of them are new anyway. Yeah, yeah, it's all buy one, get one free. So we'll start with some of the DVDs, move to video games, and finish the DVDs because we went out today intending to get more video games, focus more on that than DVDs for the sale, but end up finding more on DVD. I think that's so. Marie Kondo still. Yes, we I still, still think that's Marie Kondo. Getting rid of their box sets and then gonna regret it in a couple years, but mm -hmm. I was able to finish in one shot in one shop, like the first one we went to. Yeah, that was the first one. Just the first one we walked in, I finished getting all the. Battlestar Galactica that I needed. Oh my had, gosh, sci-fi! Obviously, if you have been watching, I have the HD DVD collection, and then I had the uh, miniseries and some stuff on DVD, but I finished everything I didn't have on DVD. That has to be somebody's so collection. This is, yeah, and this is the uh, the early 2000s uh, remake series, not the original. Uh, so we have Razor, then we have Season 1. I just think it's so absurd. None of these are the same. Oh yeah, they're all different, because that's season one is one box set, and then season two... That's just such a money grab. But then it goes back to one box like, oops, for we season changed three. Our mind. This is the most absurd. Yeah, well season four is here, and this one... This oh, one. does it say sci-fi? Oh, yeah, sci it says sci-fi channel. Yeah, when it was actually oh, the sci-fi channel, not the SYFY. Now it's... I miss sci-fi Forget channel. that. Yeah, unless the actual sci-fi. This one has the little bit of the magnetic you know, hold on the side there, and it's like really thick cardboard. And then here, it's it's actually it feels like nice feeling velvet. It feels like it, it reminds me of like a, a jewelry case. It, That's what it reminds me. It reminds like, me of a jewelry case. It looks like your Hanakimi. Like it's trying to be. Like, yeah, like some like of my, the, my Hong Kong, Kong like J uh, uh, J dramas. Yeah, yeah that, that's that what it looks case. like to yeah. me. But it's just very bizarre. But I was able to. And it's taller. Yeah. It's a tiny bit taller than yeah, the other a one. It, it, just by the tiniest hair, doesn't quite fit on the shelf. Like, it's the tiniest little bit. It's, just, uh, it's awkward. But anyway, so I was able to grab that all in one shot. And then we'll go into uh, video games. Video which games? We got some for us and some for the store because with the buy one, get one free, it worked out a lot where we could... There weren't enough that we wanted, but there were enough to where we could get one that we want and then get one for free that's for the store. So which is good. Did that way. So, made money on... On ours, yeah. this is something that Stefan is going to play, and hopefully, he's going to have supervision, <laughs> and he's going to eat and sleep while he plays this. I, this is worse than Shemba with you. So, well, this yeah, when I the, my playthrough Blue originally, Blue Blue yeah, Game of the Year was... edition with uh, Shivering Isles and stuff. Uh, I played that the Game of the Year edition on PS3 around the time PS3 the PS3 version came out. Yes. Um, but... And you were. This was a problem. This was like, yeah. he needed to go into like a 12 step program yeah. after this. But it's like, the other, the, all the Elder Scrolls games, uh, like, I've played them all, that are the ones I like, twice, ever, and then I'm pretty much just kind of done. Because he's put like so much time into it, and he's just so involved, and like, so I played on the PS3, and then sometime I'm gonna run through and play through this on the Xbox 360, and I then wish I could play it. Keep it in the collection, but probably but not play it again. their mouths freak me out. Yeah, man is not like a fan that. of the, the style of animation that but that's in general, like a lot of other stuff. But uh, yeah, I, I like the older Elder Scrolls games. I'm not that into Skyrim. This is like the last one I really like. Uh, Morrowind's my favorite, the original Xbox and PC. But yeah, so we got that. Played and then some something time. you like even better. Yes, yeah, so oh walked into the last location. I've been looking for this forever because I've been uh, looking for this for you. We forever both been looking. Too. Yeah, you've been looking for my birthday and stuff. But Persona 4 Arena. And I, last year we got number two, um, but I haven't played it yet because I'm waiting to play this. Look at this manual. Look at this manual. Yeah, this full thing color, is thick like manual. 65 like 65 pages of yeah. insanity. They'll make them like this and more. Yep. But I was incredibly excited to get this one because I was looking for it for a long time. And I could have, you know, gone online, but I like to find things in, in, per in person. Yeah, and it's cheaper that way. And there's so much to play in the meantime, it doesn't matter. 
but uh, finally grabbed this and it was doubly exciting because this is the last PlayStation 3 game that was on my list to get. This is the last PS3 game that I yeah. want. So PS3 is done. I have all the games that I want for that system. It's such yeah. a small little baby collection. Yeah, it's of by it. far like, especially because it's if it wasn't, it wouldn't stand out as much if it wasn't PlayStation 3. Because like our PS1 collection is big, our PS2 collection is by far insane. biggest. It's it's honestly almost a third of our it's total okay. collection. PS4 is gonna totally. And then PS4 is already well, PS4 is already like well into double digits. Like it's like close to 20 games probably. Already. PS4 is gonna dwarf PS2 someday. <laughs> That's never gonna happen. Yeah. Nothing said for PS2. Totally gonna happen. But, yeah. We did get a couple PS4 games. Yeah, we got a couple that you were looking for, which is nice. It is, it is. It's crazy because last year and this year, I went in with like a list of like 20 something games, and you just, they're so hard to find. Everything's hard to find now. But we got Horizon Zero Dawn, the definitive, definitive edition. I really wanted this game for forever. I can I think you'll play it, maybe. I might. I, I might. It's more. I really thing, I want think. to play this. I think it's more. I thing, think this is super yeah. cool. Because you saw that at E at E three when they announced. When it. I went to E three that one time, you know. No, we were watching E three. You saw that. And, and I, I thought this looked it. really cool. So I've heard really good things about it from mm -hmm. other people. So I'm really excited about that. And then I'm really happy about this. Yeah, I'm on the second yeah. game. We have Uncharted 4. Yep, because last year, it was last year, right? You got the collection. Last year I got, you got the collection one, two, and three. that somehow fits on one disc. <laughs> I still don't know what kind of sorcery yeah. they, they so After for that. Invention, we'll go, it'll go back upstairs oh, and play Uncharted. Oh my gosh. It's going to go back to where it belongs. It's going to go back. And you can get your coffin back. Yeah. And get PlayStation your... 3. Ugh. This is a cool one. find. I'm excited about this. I really like a lot of the indie games. Mm -hmm has fantasy violence. It's the girl and the robot. Uh, this is so cool. Yeah, the cover I love, alone looks I love like cover. something I would, like a movie I would watch. Yeah. It looks like a book I'd read. Like it just looks really pretty. I like the style. It looks really pretty. It looks like it has like a lot of puzzles and mm -hmm. adventure. And it comes with that extra CD. How cool is that? Yeah, it's the soundtrack. It has 11 tracks too. It's not like a sample. Like a yeah, lot of times it's like an these, actual full Yeah, a lot of times in these editions you get like two to four tracks, like a small thing, but it's a 11. Songs. It's really cool. I can't wait to play this. This looks so cool. It's a problem now because now I have like all these games I want to play. Yeah. Well, we got so much for each other already for <sighs> Christmas. Yeah, I know. And I want to play ukulele. Yeah. I still have to find the fish in the yonder game. Yeah, and then you'll platinum that once you find your fish. Someday I'll find my fish. Yep. Someday. Then we got a whole bunch. It's oh, here. So many games. We have a steel book of Anthem. This is not for us. It's really pretty. I really like this. I th there's so many more steelbooks now than there yeah. ever were. Yeah. Like, we never had steelbooks. Like, how many were there on, like, PS2? I feel like there weren't as many. Very few. The only one we have is the uh, Final Fantasy XII. Yeah, sure. I feel like there's so many more now. But I guess there's more limited editions of yeah. things. This, I had never heard of before. The Kingdoms of Amalur Reckoning. This looks so cool, and I'm so upset, because... It should come to the PS4. I'm not going to play this on the PS3. But if it was on the PS4, I would totally yeah. play it. Oh, yeah. It looks so cool. Someone needs to buy the rights to this. And then make it for me. Just remake it for me. Just re-release it. Just re-release it. It's fine. We got PlayStation 2, because... Always got to get PS2. You have to get PS2. We got Persona 3F. Is that what it is? 3F? F-E-S? F-E-S, yeah. F-E-S? Makes me think of uh, Fez. Petri Makes me think of Fez, Fez. the '70s show. <laughs> but, Petri Fez. Yeah. Uh, yeah, this and this is uh, for the store because I have this, the same edition and beat that and the many exact years ago. Same edition. Many years ago. I'm excited about this. I if it was on the PS4, yeah. I would keep it. Think, I'm still. I think you might. I'm conflicted. Because as the original. If anyone's actors. played this, let me know because I, I want to know. Should I keep yeah. this? Because Amanda is a fan of the series. I love Dark That's, Angel. Yeah. We own Dark Angel. This actually has the voice actors. It has, well, it has Jessica Alba and uh, Michael, Michael Weatherly. So that's really cool. I feel like maybe I'll play it. You might, I don't know. I don't know. You might I think, don't we'll know. hang on to it for a little while and see if you want to play it. I think I don't know. you might want that. Here's a very rare game. <laughs> yeah, There's yeah. only like one copy ever made Ever's of this game. game. It's called. Well, that can't be true. We own two. That's true. We do own two. It's by Namco. It's Tech Tag, Tag, Tag Tournament. Tournament. So. Very rare. 
Ultra rare. I'm gonna put that in the listing. When we put you it put the, yeah. I'm gonna put ultra <laughs> rare. That seems to sell things faster. But, ultra yeah. rare. Still, still one of my favorite fighting games. Easily top five for fighting games, and probably definitely my most played number of hours with friends. Tekken Tag Tournament. Still, that that launch game for PS2. I looked at the Tekken one on the PS4. Oh, I'm still con yeah, I'm I conflicted. I haven't. I, I'm conflicted. I didn't like six at all. The last one I liked was five. But I've heard really good things about this last one. I don't know. Maybe we'll find out someday. I saw this and it called to me. I really wish this was on the Switch or the PS4. It's avoid his blob. Avoid his blob. It just looks. It just looks really cute. Yeah. And you said this edition of it is exclusive. Yeah, because it's a remake of an NES game. So. I wish. I wish I had time to play all these things, but yeah, there, that's, there are always certain games where it's like that looks I'm really not cool, play it. but oh uh, yeah, I'm not gonna time for it, so I don't get it. Yeah, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna play it on the Wii. Too many games. Too you many games. Two Lego Indiana Jones games. For some reason, Lego games sell really well. Yeah, I don't I, understand why. I don't get either. I don't I've like... never. I don't think either of us have ever been no, Lego games into the no. Lego thing, but don't get it. But... A lot of people really like it. That's all that really matters. Sonic and the Secret Rings. I'm excited for the new movie. I know you want to see it. We'll, we'll no, see because you want to see it. We're going to see it in theaters care, because we must support them because they did a nice job yeah. making Sonic not scary because Sonic was really scary and now he's not. I thought this was Zombie University, <laughs> but that's not what it was. It's Zombie U. I feel like that should be Zombie University. That would be a, a good game. Apparently, this is an exclusive because it's called. The U, yeah, th this version is, yeah. Yeah, this is very early uh, Wii U. Wii U! And then some more Legos. Yep. Marvel Superheroes. And Batman 3. These Wii U games sell really fast. I don't know why. Well, because not everything's imported over, and even if you have, um, it's ported over to, say, a Switch or PS4 or whatever, the Wii U version is going to be a little different. Well, because it's, it's always going to, yeah, it's going to, something's going to be a little unique, and then it's also a collection that people that want to pick a console to make a, have a complete collection of, it's one that's very doable, because of the, the small library, so I think a lot of people will do that. Now, some more DVDs. Now, DVDs, we really killed it for DVDs. Fantastic, we have the Tremors Attack Pack, which is Attack. Tremors 1 to 4. Uh, these all, were always on the Sci-Fi channel. Yeah, these are the only ones I really like. I don't really like the two newer ones. Um, I hated the TV series when it was on. And I don't think that I ever saw the TV series. Yeah, it was bad. But I like these. So, Tremors, got that. Just missing the first two movies on Laserdisc, and then we're done with Tremors. Tremors. We got Tailspin Volume 3. We have that on Disney Plus Some right classic, now. Classic, yeah. And then 25th actually... Anniversary Volume 1 of DuckTales. We own so little in the way of yeah. like Disney cartoons. Yeah, a lot of the old Disney cartoons and Disney Channel, we just haven't, we watched them all as kids, and we just haven't picked them up yet. Haven't, you know, haven't run into them. Yeah, so, yeah, Disney you know. stuff's really hard, so Disney Plus is good for that, just because... Probably, you know, one of the bigger shots here, we're going for a couple different case style, like complete sets of MASH, the thin case release and the original... Um, and then Doctor's Bag. Oh, wider, yeah, the Doctor's Bag, the big collection, the wider ones, we got some of VHS, but uh, we're getting closer to finishing our MASH collection. We have Season 6, and Season 7. This is really exciting for me because we own a lot of MASH, but we own a lot of the, the like, first part. Yeah, some of the later of seasons the, we didn't have copies of yet. And now that they're off Netflix for, they've been off Netflix for a for while, while now. now. Yeah, no, we can, watch we can only watch season 10. Yeah, because we watch, I feel like we've watched the well, same episodes. We watch a lot of MASH. We do. So the amount, like times we watch through the DVDs and we watch like upstairs in the bedroom all my, the uh, collector's VHS. edition VHS tapes and things and uh, then season 11. And then we were watching a little bit of this earlier. It's the finale, the goodbye for a while, and amen. It's a three-disc edition. I really wanted this because all the extra features. So we have it's the one disc is the final episode. Chicken. Probably one of the best, if not the best, like emotionally episodes of TV ever. Chicken. I know. And then it's a bunch of special features, uh, different uh, like interviews, the anniversary, a uh, 30th anniversary reunion documentary, memories of Mash documents, multiple documentaries. All kinds of stuff on and here. So like, yeah, there's like two discs. Yeah, I didn't know they had that. That's really cool. Mm -hmm. I like that one. Then another one we are getting down to as far as like what we want for the collection. Season 15 of South Park. 
because uh, South Park, first you know decade of it, I absolutely loved, and I really enjoy those. But over time, it's, I don't know it's kind of lost me. It lost me around the last season. I really, really enjoyed was season 17. Uh, then when they tried to do more of the season-long story arcs and stuff, just I don't know, it just didn't quite work for me. But so this is towards the end of what I want for it's South okay. Park. Okay, we have Rick and 15. Morty. I know you love Rick and Morty. So I'm sure that Amanda's no, a couple here that Amanda's well, yeah, four in a row that you have no interest in. That I like. Uh, but Mad About You, Seasons 1 and 2. That's a quirky dog. Yeah. But I like, I like Mad About You. Hogan's Heroes. One of my favorites. <laughs> Complete second season. I'm not a fan of that so, era of not a show, television. Yeah, I love 60s TV. But uh, not a show where I'd want like the whole series. But That's all you want from that, yeah, isn't this, it? This is so, only, yeah, we're done with Hogan's that's Heroes. That's done. There's only one more season of Mad About You. We're done with that. We're done with Taxi now. We have the... Second season. Look at Dane DeVio's face. He's so cute. And he's so cute. <laughs> well, we're done with that. We're also done with uh, the Lucy show. I prefer I Love Lucy. Definitely just tough one for that. But if it was the Lucy show, we have some in these uh, classic TV collections of random episodes. And then this is a good set, a four disc set, 28 episodes of the Lucy show. That's such a weird show. Yeah, I know you don't like this one. It's all these I don't think in it's individual, very funny. like plastic. And those cases are funny. weird. Yeah, they are really weird. But yeah, I don't like it as I much as I weird. They made but... like they did weird things with DVDs for a while with the cases. Like yeah. you couldn't decide what they wanted to do. And yeah, I mean anything is better though. Super crazy. Anything's variety. better than those one with the cardboard front, the little like <sighs> snap. Case I don't know things. what they thought they were doing with that. Yeah, those were bad. It's like extra secure, but it's cardboard. Yeah, but the... <laughs> so it doesn't really make yeah. sense. So yeah, we made a out like bandits with DVDs and did pretty good at video games, got some stuff that we were looking for, which is nice and mm -hmm. happy to be done with the PS3 completely. I know. 360 is down, down to two games that we want for we're that, almost, so there's no there. lot. But yeah, so another successful Black Friday. Yes. Uh, I, I love going there every year just to that place, nowhere else, avoid the malls and all that crap and all the sales that are actually not really great sales anyway, but they <laughs> always have good, they're always, every year, it's buy one, get one free for... Um, pretty, pretty much, much every, everything, just about everything. Ish, except if it's yeah. in the case. Yeah, but and they are packing those cases full of yeah, stuff. Yeah, I mean, it's, so you can't do buy one get one free on like the turbo complete graphics. in box turbo graphics games they have in the case. Like you know, I can't use it for that. I but wonder like, why. Yeah, but anything more common, like anything from like the you know Atari through the NES all the way up to like PS4, it's all buy one get one free as long as it's not like high dollar stuff. Did you get anything so. for Black Friday? Do you even go yes, out for you Black go out. Friday? Because I know this is the only time we ever go out for Black Friday. Yeah, yeah, and and this is the only time we really go out specifically to that store, knowing we're gonna put some money down to buy video games and stuff. Like otherwise, we only go there really for the dollar DVD sales. That's yeah, the only, throughout yeah, the year. that's pretty much. That's about it, dollar DVD sales. So. Yeah, I think a good one. But yeah, let us know below if you got any stuff for Black Friday. Link us to your video if you have a video of you know what you got. Uh, I'd love to hear what you guys are grabbing and what you will be playing towards the end of this year. And in case you're wondering, you're watching this video, um, I haven't done my Shemu three like Final Thoughts video yet. He's been playing. So it's not there because I'm still playing it. I'm like at sixty hours, maybe and more. And he's almost but... done with the capsule toys. Yeah. To whoever helped him. On yeah, I couldn't last find machine. Because I had every single Thank capsule you. toy in the game except the one, the, the, the set of keys. And I couldn't find it anywhere. And, and then, so I went so on Twitter, like, without spoilers, like, is this just in the end game area? Or, like, I, I'm, or am I just crazy missing it? And it's like, it's, yeah. So, I just so thank you to the yeah. nice person. So I don't have to go insane. But yeah, otherwise, I'm almost entirely done with Shema 3. Oh my god. And I'd be doing that. He's, he's chopped so many pieces of wood. I'm, I'm, oh my god, I'm, he's like a wood. I'm embarrassed. I w I'm glad there's no counter that says like how long and how hours you spent be. chopping wood. Because I just it found it to be so rhythmic and like hypnotic and like it was an addictive way to make money. Like I love doing some other odd jobs and like even like you know, trying to catch the ducks for like all these other things you could do for money. Collecting the herbs is great. You know, driving the forklift, I actually like, I love that. But chopping wood for some reason. I is love great. the old people behind you, like the old men. Cheering you on. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Chop that wood. Yeah, yeah. Especially when you get like a very good or like an excellent, and I love the music changes, and it's like yeah. So. But, yeah. But it's almost done the journey, yeah. and then the PlayStation can go back. So that'll where be it up. Belongs. Yeah. I mean, full of course of other videos coming in the future, and then uh, to cap the year off, I know I'm already planning with the big year I, uh, with like Shenmue Three, and the fact that I played so many games this year more than normal. Both of us did because we were really. Video game was like an escape for us this year. 
And this year has been like five years yeah, long. Yeah, so because of that, I'm definitely going to do a video at the end of the year, like my favorite games I played throughout the year. Oh, I, played I don't know so if I can many do games. that. I don't know. If you... I don't know. I don't so know if many. you can pick. I don't know. So, I'm not good at picking. Yeah, so we, yeah, we'll see. That's kind of the uh, a look at what's going to be coming up here. And again, thank you for watching and for coming back yet another year for our Black Friday video.